shout out to all my amazing members and patrons for going above and beyond in supporting the channel. They are Samadina, Rick Hemingway, Charlene Kelly, Yumi, Madlow, I Am Beast, mds 84 za Justin Rice, Killer Bunny 264, Ozzy Pozzy, Kone 76, Onakian, Belako, Steve Jacques, Iron Man, Pierce Ramsey, Nathan V, Zareel, Autogasm, Amy, and Hakaba. To join them, check out the links in the description down below. Hey everyone, and welcome back to Wild West Mod. So, um, I still need to do the inventory management over here. I just thought, you know what? It's almost night time. Let's go see if we can't do this quest quickly. And then at night time, we have to take this ladder out and then still loot this place. Um, I wanted to do all of that before we start this episode, but then it's going to be completely night by the time we start this. Also have to be careful just in case there's a dog over here. At least we do have frames. So if I have to stack up and away from a dog, hopefully I'm fast enough. <laughs> I know sometimes, I can't remember exactly which ones had dogs, but I know some of these POIs are really uh, treacherous, so we have to be very careful. If we can get more kerosene, I need 300 kerosene for one Molotov. Then you know, that will be able to protect us from like a massive wandering horde or an insane amount of tough enemies or something like that. So if we see something like that, we have to keep our eyes open. That says it's downstairs. Yeah, this is a bunker. This is a bunker, which means the, the well is at the back. The hole. Hello. Okay, so you hit me, I hit you. Mutual destruction. Let me just please see if we can't eat this because our food is super low. And drink this as well. And then only lock four slots. And then I need to get this torch back because now we need to be able to see at the back of here. If I'm not mistaken, down here is like a ton of burnt enemies. Let me just make sure there's nothing else over here. Were you? Oh, you were in the tree. That is pretty nasty. Oh! I thought you were a little bit further away. <laughs> I thought I had time to quickly place the torch down and then face him. But I look oh yeah, I almost forgot about that. There are some pure eyes that are just like completely in the trees. So from now on, we'll have to keep an eye out on the, the air as well. It seems like it only was this one outside and then these inside. I think there's burnt dudes down here. The snake's dead. It's getting dark over here. So as soon as they start running, we might have a problem. That's messed up. The snake's hidden right above your head. You can't even see it's there until it's super late. I'm just tap, tap, tapping forward to make sure we don't get overrun. Whoops. Is that a dog? What is that? Is that a vulture or a dog? What is that? Oh, oh no. Yep, it's one of those. It's one of those. It's one of those. These things are insanely tough to kill. What are you... Uh, can you climb? I wonder. And that's an ugly looking spider as well. I need to run. Are you guys actually able to get out? Oh, this is... Oh, why do I keep falling in? What is that? It looks like a lizard kind of thing. This is only a level one, but what the hell? How am I supposed to kill this? If I had a Molotov, this would be easy. Nice, the spider looking thing. Oh no, it's a rat. It seems like it's a rat monster. What the hell? I should probably make a way for it to get out so it's easier for me to kill them. But I have no idea how fast they are. It's so easy to miss. And it's getting late. The, the longer we take with this, the longer it's gonna, the worse it's gonna be. I wonder if I shouldn't try and make them a way out. They're destroying the ladder underneath me. I give them a way out like that. Oh, yep, 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 yep. What the hell? Oh, yep, that's a spider, all right. They're really creepy. Ooh, oh, it's a shame I didn't have light on that. Just I wanted to take a, a closer look. That is creepy as oh no! no, 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 no. Almost forgot how tough and fast these guys are. He's gonna be mad now as well, so I have to be careful. Unfortunately, I left my torch downstairs. Oh no, no! 
Woo! What the hell? Okay, I played out. Nice. Here's the other one. Hello. The fact that I can... Oh, it broke my arm. Seems like we can't skin them because they're technically um, zombies. It's so dark for me even now, right, guys, right now, guys. So I don't know. I hear the snake downstairs. I don't think it could come up. Hello, snake. Woo, this is dangerous. Okay, I need to make more light. Please tell me there weren't more of these freaks down here. But now that broke my arm just now. Or, yeah, that sprained or broke my arm and it gave me a concussion. That was so not worth this just now. This is a level one. Is there anything else over here? Nope. Okay, so yeah, that was definitely not worth it, uh, uh, effort just now. I wonder when the trailer closes. Okay, let's go back to the trailer. I'm gonna have to put my lights away so they can't see me. Something's already chasing me. Okay, yeah, that was terrifying. Hey, don't oh come in no! Here I wonder. Nope, can't talk to him because it's nighttime. Okay, so we'll have to hand this in in the morning. My base is north. Ooh, okay, uh, the fact that we just survived that at least is good. But day, oh, that's a cop. What's the point of surviving that if uh, it still broke my arm and gave me a concussion? I'll have to kill this one at least. That was creepy. I don't know if you guys saw that just now. Oh, it was super dark, so I don't think you oh, got that. That was a bat just now. Okay, let me just quickly break this ladder over here before uh, they get to us, and then hopefully no one interrupts us right now. Okay, so at least the ladder is up and running. I need to be careful, because if that cop sees me from downstairs, it's going to vomit at me. If it vomits at me right now, it might destroy our boxes as well. So I'm just going to do that, just in case we die. And then we have to probably just quickly go and sort our food and drink. So we can put all the drinks and food together. I'll put all of the seeds and farming together as well. We can drink that, we can drink that, that's food, that's food. I should probably make myself another... Oh, I should do this. I should make myself another uh, torch or two as well. I'm just afraid I might call in a screamer. Since we just saw what the new freaks look like, so I don't know. I don't even really want to imagine what the streamers are going to do. Let's put all of this away, that away. We can actually turn this into cobble blocks. We already have 100 blocks. Not bad at all. Damn. Okay, so then over here we'll do all of our weapons. These weapons are still... Yeah, they're the same no matter what. So we'll do the weapons over here and the ammo. Uh, that's a weapon. Ammo, ammo. I should probably see if I can get myself like a hunting rifle or a pipe hunting rifle or something for long distance sniping. I'm not going to be using the club, so I'm going to be putting that away. We can't make a bow right now, it's way too early. And then all of these are parts and stuff. It's ammo. You can read this. I'd be careful not to make too much noise right now. I really don't want to mess with them. I just think the stag and clay, you can actually make a weapon with that, so I'll put that over there for now. And then over here, we'll put all the tools and any mods that we might have. But as you can see, we don't really have that many tools anyways. Do we have any stone? Yeah, we do. Okay, cool. I want to make myself a campfire over here. Put that over the back. I want to make a campfire, and then I want to put one of these over here into that. Oh, also, we don't have any painkillers, unfortunately. So that's the only thing. If I had some painkillers, I'd actually go and confront the cop. But if that concussion hits while we are busy facing the cop, that might actually slow us down enough for it to kill us. We have to be super, super careful right now. The med, that is just for dysentery and stuff, yeah. Unfortunately. Okay, so this is drinks and food. Let's put this down. Oops. 
See, if that happens, this is what's happening right now. If that happens while we face a cop, we slow down and it hits us. Ooh, we did. So we say meds and farming. Weapons. And ammo. I need to uh, start typing more. The more I type, the faster I type. But since I type so little, <laughs> I'm a little bit slow. Okay, we can say vehicles and parts. We can say armor over here. Armor and dies. This is miscellaneous. And over here we'll put resources. Technically, I usually also have a box of all the stuff we want to sell, but for now, we don't really have enough to sell. Okay, I need to make way more arrows. We can make so many more arrows. Damn. That's fuel, that's vehicle, that's miscellaneous, miscellaneous, miscellaneous. Free resin is technically resources. That's vehicle. Miscellaneous. Resources. That's a drink that we have to keep on us. That's miscellaneous. Miscellaneous, miscellaneous. I'm not going to do this quest until we actually have weapons to take down that feral white. That gunslinging white can be super, super tough. And if we do it too early, we might definitely die. Okay, so vehicle parts go over here. Resources go over there. And miscellaneous goes over here. It's a shame there's no like box sharing, inventory sharing or kind of uh, things as well. Okay, for now we'll put this in there. And then I have to make sure that we can actually make some food. Acorn flowered oak seed so you have to use an oak seed oak tree seed to uh, to make the acorn flower you need two apples oh yeah apples you get by chopping down trees so the sooner we can make ourselves an axe then just see tomahawk tomahawk spike i think we used this one last time we need six tree resin to oh we need a ton of forged iron can we make a forge nope still lock behind the books and then a workbench same thing right yeah Okay, so for now, we have to go downstairs and loot this place. But we have to be careful because of how dangerous it is over here. We don't really have much healing left. And we don't really have that much food and water anyways to... Do, look at that. It only gives five food and two health. Might be able to make some bacon and eggs, but I think we still need the book for that as well. Where's that cop? Where's that cop? I might be able to snipe him. He's all the way over there. If I can see him before he sees me, I can snipe him. There's three enemies over there. I'm recording this during the day, so for me, this screen is completely dark. Okay, let's just put this torch away quickly. I want to get inside the POI, and as soon as I'm inside, we can put some lights. Please don't tell me anything came inside of here. Okay, so now we can actually have a look at what's inside. There's a safe over there, but we don't have any lockpicks, unfortunately. Please tell me that's a crawl outside. Oh, I'm not crouching. Oh, I wasn't crouching just now. Nice. Beaker. We have to make sure that we're crouching over here so we don't draw the attention of all the enemies outside. You make less noise when you're crouching than when you're standing up. Jam, jam, jam. Kerosene, please. Nice. At the moment, I think I'm going to focus more on having a horse than having a vehicle. So all I need to do is make sure we chop a ton of trees and we'll be able to feed and heal the horse. And then the kerosene we can immediately just use for like molotovs and stuff. Okay, I wonder if this is actually something. I want to put this down somewhere, but there's no place. I don't know if this is just a block or if it's actually a box. So we'll try and break it and see if it's anything. If it's nothing, then we know the rest is also nothing. I want to go inside and clear the place out as well, and then we finally have a base. I just need some uh, concussion meds. So the sooner the trader opens, the better. Okay, at least we have our stone on us. Nope. Nothing. Okay. That is unfortunate. I have to make sure that I scroll to the torch before I pick it up so that when I pick it up, there's no darkness. Please, I need some pain meds. At least the sprained arm, as long as I don't do power attacks, the arm should be fine in like a minute. 
But the concussion can really seriously end us. Go back here, grab this. I can get more bones and stuff, but at the moment we don't need any bones. How long would it take me to open this container up with here? If I was to wail on it. Only 12 damage. It might take the whole night to open, but it might be worth it. So as long as nothing comes for me, I'm just going to try and do this. Okay, so as you guys can see, it is almost 4 in the morning. It's half past 3. And the enemies, for some reason, are too dumb to go through the wooden uh, blocks over here. So they go inside and they try and break through the floor. Which, obviously, they're never going to be able to do. Okay, so let's just do this. I want to make sure... Oh, it's a shame the concussion hasn't hit in a while. This is disable... Oh, this is an anti-rad or rad remover mod. I have to put that on this and then the radiation the enemies won't be radiated anymore. Although, um, yeah, we're not going to get them soon, I hope. Okay, now I have to get out of here. At least we've looted this whole bottom. I need to get out of here and just get onto that ladder, but I don't know where it is. And I don't know where these enemies are. These concussion don't play up right now. Hello, hello, my dear. Bye-bye, my dear. Oh, I thought they were inside, but it seems they were acting on the walls on the outside. Okay, so... <laughs> um, that was not worth the whole night worth of banging, but hey... At least we're going to get more as soon as the trader open because we have to hand this in. Put that over there. Technically, I can actually put that inside of the year. And I should probably see what kind of foods and stuff I can make, right? Let's just first make sure we have all of the space that we need. It's farming. Guys, go over there. Vehicle parts. Lanius. Resources. Weapons. Weapon, weapon, weapon. That is technically also weapon, but we'll keep that on us for now. And that goes over there. I actually want to put that on my bow because we're more likely to snipe a radiator than fight it head on. So if we can get that first shot in sneak damage, it's double the damage and it stops the regen. And then we can fight it with a knife. Okay, what I want to do quickly is just grab all of the drinks over here. Bring some food and see what we can actually make. As you can see, it's basically nothing. We need... Cooked water. Okay, let's just see. We can actually make proper water. We'll do that. And then as soon as we have cooked water, we actually need to make like something like this. Apple pie. We don't have apples yet. Uh, honey, pumpkin pie. It's weird that bacon and eggs is locked behind food. But you can make all of these fancy foods. Although, it's you need so much to make them that it, <laughs> it's going to take a while anyways. Honeycomb bread. Shamway bread pudding. Ooh, this is something we actually make early on. We just need to kill a boar or two. Get some honey from one of the tree stumps. And we have eggs and fat. Nice. I need to heal. I hope the trader actually has uh, stuff to heal me. I need to heal this concussion right now. I don't know how much it's going to cost, but we need it desperately. Okay, the blocks we can keep for now uh, under resources. And we'll keep that. And it is all that's locked. Okay, so I wonder when the trader opens. At 4? It is now morning, so we should be safe. I have to be careful because that cop is still in the area. I wonder if I can take him down. Hello, my lady. Oh, my butterfly. Okay, there's a mo over there we have to be careful of. There's this lady. You have to be careful because they can actually aggro. So focus on one at a time until you actually have them dead and then go to the next one. You don't want to make all of them mad and have them like 20 zombies chasing after. I still have to loot the inside of this place, but we can do that next night. Okay, that was a bad shot. I should have gone a little bit higher. I hit him in the chest just now instead of the head. I did barely any damage. I definitely hit him night. I don't think I'll be able to kill him. Oh, nice. Okay. I want to make sure I can actually kill them to get the XP. If he just explodes, then obviously you don't get the XP from that. I need to be careful because of all the shadows. I realized while I was doing the one stream that I was playing without shadows. So now with Vezuke's last like six or ten episodes, that shadow's on. And now over here as well, you can see shadows are on, but it makes it so dark in the shadows. I hope you guys can at least see I need to be careful because that rat-looking thing acts like a spider. Sounds like a spider, acts like a spider. 
I don't know what the hell it is. I should have probably checked the console after it died. Why didn't I? If I had checked the console, I might have actually seen, okay, Jean killed this kind of enemy. Okay, it seems hey, you are open. I never would have guessed Trouble, you thank you. But you did. We're so gonna be able to make go. a whole base soon. Okay, uh fetch northeast. We wanna go super, super close by. The I closer the better. For you. Good Grab luck. tag. Okay, and now we have quite a bit of cash. We should also probably check our back just in case something sneaks up. If I can buy this level four tomahawk. Ooh, that's amazing. We can only make a level one right now. This resets day four, so I have to grind and grind and grind like crazy to get that. Unfortunately, there's no painkillers. Damn, I really need a painkiller right now. Okay, pipe shotgun. I should probably That's see if I can't make a pipe weapon today. of some kind. So pipe. Rifle, for example. We do have glue, we do have pipes. And we are going in that direction. So let's just make one. We have some 7.62 ammo. So if we see something in distance like a, a deer or something we want to kill, we know now that the bow is still too weak. So if we see a deer or something in the distance, or even a dog or a spider, we can snipe them. Now we just need this, and <laughs> only glue. Uh, only poor glue. Okay, we're going to do that. We're going to put that away. Resources away. I'm going to put that away for now. I need to make more blocks anyways. That I should technically take because we can get fatigued. And then I need to make some food. I'm going to have to eat these for now, but I need to make sure we can actually get bacon and eggs soon. So we have to find a bookstore of some kind just to make sure we can read it. Also, while I was mining the, that uh, safe, I put two points into Minus 69er and Mother Load. So just to help me break that thing a little bit faster. But because of our concussion, my pack mill is not working as it's intended to work. So we are kind of screwed at the moment. Agility, let's go higher with that one. And that's also being affected. Great. Okay, and then ammo, we should have some 7.62, right? Yeah. Just a few, but it's enough to actually get us started at least. Seems it's very close by, the thing we have to do. Didn't we already do that one? I mean, I'm not complaining. If, if we've already done one, then at least I know what to expect. More or less. And I didn't see you. If I saw you beforehand, I would have definitely tried to kill you sooner. I might actually just wait until it stands still and then try again. It looks like a wooden building over there. Oh, no, 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 no. I hate quests like this. There was a barge of some kind, a sunken ship with a mast sticking out. We did that last time and there were um, actual feral white and stuff sticking out. The fetch is right there, so all I have to do is grab it. Why don't you pick these lights up? I think you can wrench them. I, I, I'm going to try and wrenching them after this. I have to be careful. Sometimes a boat like this has like dogs and stuff guarding it. I really don't feel like dying right now. And unfortunately, it's so dark, you can't really see anything. It seems you're supposed to fall through there. Yeah, that's open over there. Hello, hello, hello. See how sneaky these birds can be. Yeah, if you can break that door for me, that would be amazing. Another bird, where? Probably inside this room. If it is, that's going to help me, so that's good. Come on, painkiller. You can do it. Oh no, it's not inside. You can do it! Ooh, you're still alive. Ooh, I need to be careful. My HP is not looking good right now. I already had to use all my bandages to heal as much as I could. I need more healing. How many more vultures are there? Seems like you're supposed to be able to loot that, but I can't. Okay, can I sneak a shot through here? Oh, the chem station's in the way. Can I shoot through this? Okay, I've definitely hit it just now. Okay, I think there's a crawler. Ooh, there's guys on the shore. 
As long as I don't have weapons, we should be fine. Hello, Lumberjack. Dude, stand still, please. I need to bleed you out like this because I can't jump in there with you there. That's not going to happen, thank you. I think all the vultures are at least dead. I just have to get my spoils of war. I wonder how long it's going to take before he bleeds out. Because usually this dude has a ton of HP. Here you go. Put my stamina back. I don't want to jump in there blindly. And just make sure this is reloaded just in case you have to give a shot. Yeah, that does not look suspicious at all. <laughs> There's a door right there. If I could just get one painkiller, we can treat our concussion right now. It's probably going to have to run out, uh, run its course. Okay, we can put the torch down somewhere over here. I want to make sure every time we see these vultures, we skin them. Because this way we can get a ton, or an endless supply of feathers. I mean, look at this. I already have 220 arrows. Just thanks to all of the vultures we've been coming across. Steel, not bad. That's broken. And uh, yeah, there's no end loot in this thing. That's too small, I think, to have end loot. I want to see if we can't buy some food from the trader. Now that I think about it, we can easily. Just be careful getting out of here. How do I get out? Okay, that's out. Okay, where is that, uh, the businessman still ashore? Okay. So just if we go this way and swim, and then I don't have to worry about the, uh, the dudes over there. I think there's also like fish traps and stuff all around. You have to be careful because there are zombies underneath the water. So if you're not paying attention, you can easily get attacked from the side, and then you're like, what the hell happened? I want to so bad. I want to. No, I won't be able to get sneak damage. It saw me just now, right? One shot kill. Nice. See, this is why I need this weapon. As long as I do a headshot, we can actually instantly kill our meat. And I have so much meat already. We just need to get the books to be able to cook these. Oh yeah, the trader also sells some books. I should probably check. The trader might actually have some books on cooking or vehicles or something for us. It's a shame he doesn't have a concussion pill. Just need one. Don't step on that. It's gonna burn. Surprise, surprise. Okay, 762 sharp. Oh, it's called sharp. Okay. I'll take that, thank you. Here you go. Any more jobs? Super close by, please. Fetch the west. Oh, crispy books. Yes, 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 yes. Books. If you're lucky, then pull this off. Big headed shotgun, needle and thread, out of mining. What is this? Uncover more sparkle with this uh favorite trick of mine. Adds a small chance to find red gems. I'm gonna be mining that much. Repair tool crafting. It's 300 per book, so I'll rather wait until there's something with food. And already, he's only selling this kind of food. Thank it's not. God, oh, wait, 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 wait. Where's the vending machine? A nickel ain't worth a dime anymore. Oh, XP elixirs. Yes. Let's level up a little bit faster. Need some coffee. Do I have enough cash left? 288. Yes. Unfortunately, there's no food, right? I can't see any food over here. Okay, so we have enough for now. I'm going to drink that just before. Where is this bookstore? I'm going to drink the XP elixir just before going in. It might be a waste for the smaller POIs. But at the same time, I think I should probably wait until level 2, right? If I get tier 2 POIs, there's more enemies. Although, some of these book, uh, some of these stores and stuff look kind of big. I mean, look at this thing. Wait, is that the... Oh, that's just a small town. Okay, so there's some buildings over here. Nice. I mean, we do have the desert right next to us as well. I want to just, where, how do we see where we are? We go on the escape of here. It has to be either here or here, but it, I can't really see on the map. I think at the beginning that was the map for it, but that hasn't been changed, if I'm not mistaken. Oh, this bookstore, this crappy thing. The crappy thing, there's almost never any books of here. Ooh, there's a fort of here. What's this fort called? I could live inside the fort. The only problem is it's too big and it's a little bit too far away from the trader. Crooked Arrow Fort. Uh, Your feral, just please don't tell me you have a gun. 
As long as you're just feral, I'm able to deal with you, kind of. Come on. It's terrifying dealing with ferals early game. Because you literally don't have enough stamina or weapons to really kill them. There you go. And they might have weapons in their hands as well, so you have to be super careful. I should have probably read the books first and then restarted it to get more books early game. But I mean, I don't want to cheese it too much. I have to put a torch down. Over there. Like we can always just move the torch around if we need. There's definitely going to be at least one more down here with us. Come on. Ooh. It's weird. The book just now said spear hunter, but that was clearly not a spear. Okay, I'm going to do this. I need to make sure to check the bodies to get the arrow back. Because you can get the arrow back. Not, not all the time, not, uh, because sometimes it just breaks on contact. But we might actually be able to get an arrow or two back. Oh, you just spawned in. Probably make sure this completely reloads before we switch to what other oh everything whatever else. Ooh, my tongue tied. You always have to make sure it reloads fully. If you interrupt the action or the animation, it doesn't reload. So in your time of need, if you actually need to shoot, you can't because you interrupt yourself. Oh, there's enemy outside. I wonder what is it? Is it feral? It's just chilling outside, so I should probably go clear it before I do anything else. Fetch is upstairs. If I can at least see where the enemy is, that's going to put my mind at ease. I hear footsteps, but I can't tell exactly where it's coming from. Look how small these books are. That was actually a book that you can read. Vehicle, batter up, tools, big hitters. I need food, man. Medical, explosive, knife guy, and crap inventor. Okay, we need books for the, the food. It's a shame this isn't a clear so you can see where all the dots are. I need to put this in a way so I can actually see them. Did I hit the door? And especially with 821 now being able to see through doors, you can interrupt her attack. And if she attacks, she destroys the door, not you. And since this is reloaded, I can now do that. Ooh, Big Mama is mad. There you go. There you go. But we have to be careful now because she destroyed the door. But if there's something tough over here, we won't be able to deal with it. I think if I'm not mistaken, those were the only books, right? Which is unfortunate. I need way more books. There's definitely an enemy inside that office over there. And there's an enemy outside. There you go. I'm going to destroy that box at the back. I'm gonna destroy the box without destroying anything else. Oh, look at all the books over here. There's way more books than usual. This actually half makes it worth going for these. Hello. I saw your shadow just now before you dropped. I was kind of expecting you, my dude. At least we can hear them drop or uh, at least see them in the corner of our eyes, we should be safe. Hello, hello. Kerosene, thank you. Probably get all the resources every time I'm here. We have a shovel that can do it, so why not? Okay, now I just ran out of stamina. Accidentally hit this thing over here instead of the resources. Ooh. 
Hello. I saw the texture of the wall slightly different. Nice. That's the nice thing about playing with textures really high. You can see if the uh, the wall looks off and then you can just go from there. The only bad thing is I, I really hope there's no food over here because I just spent all my cash. Okay, phew. <laughs> the only drinks. I mean, it would have been cool if there was food, but since we just spent all our cash, that would suck because we wouldn't be able to buy it. Okay. Uh, do this, do this, do this. Already got the resource to the right. I know there's a vulture up here. I'm trying to get around it without... Oh, oh. Something just tried spawning in over there. Oh, we got some uh, lockpicks as well. Look how small these books are. It's so easy to miss. If you're not looking for a book, you won't even see it's there. Okay, so just one more enemy on the other side of this. I'm gonna make as fast as I possibly can because it is actually the end of the episode. But I wanna at least get this place in. Technically, I can go inside the room and wait for him to break the door or bleed out. I think he just bled out. <laughs> that wasn't too fast. Ooh, look at the art in the game. Nice. Now we go up over here. Are you feral or something? No vulture. Ah, uh, there's a vulture, damn it. I need to time it so well because at the moment the vulture, if I'm not, if I'm just a split second too slow, the vulture can do some serious damage to us. I have to open up those two boxes over there and loot the crap over here. They're just the nonsense. Uh, the fetch is also over this side. Okay, bookstore box. No food box. No food bo uh, books, unfortunately probably see what the food books look like because I might have actually read one without even realizing it. Nice. Storage pocket mod. Steroids. Nice. The steroids will come in handy if we really need to open up some space but at the moment at least we don't need it. That on there. This one's weaker. Oh, I could have sold it. Okay, let's really go to the trader and hand this in. We need to get as many quests done as possible because I want to get myself that horse. I, th I think the first one's going to be a uh, bicycle, then the horse. Oh, I should also not spend any more cash because I need to save 7,000 for the tomahawk. I'm probably just going to have to make my own. This is going to be too expensive to wait because I just bought a ton of food and stuff anyways. Okay, so if you guys like this episode, please like, show, please leave a like and share with your friends. Any comments, tips and feedback, leave it down below. And if you guys are new to this channel, please remember to hit the subscribe button for more of this content. See you guys next time for some more Wild West shenanigans. Members and patrons get shoutouts in all of my videos, get access to a private members only Discord channel. And as a thank you for supporting the channel, get access to my 7 that I server. If interested, check out the links in the description down below.